Hey guys, this is Pio K. Tsunami, and as promised, here's my walkthrough for Lola. Now, for those of you who do not know what Lola is, it is a program that I've been developing that will analyze your League of Legends match history and create charts and tables with the data so you can see what you're doing well on with different champions, what needs improvement, and as well as an overtime analysis so you can see your progression. Now, Lola stands for League of Legends Analytics. And remember that this program is still in its alpha version with lots of planned features and development for the future. <clears throat> well, let's get started. This is the main screen where you enter your summoner name. After you exit the program, it automatically saves your profile and puts it in this box down here. Now, after entering your summoner name or selecting a profile, click I like my pie OK, and you'll see that more options will pop up. The first on the list is New Entry, which brings up an entry form for you to enter your match history in. Now, in the future, it will pull this information directly from League of Legends match history so that you don't have to enter all this in manually. Also, keep in mind that all the information on this form is optional except your summoner name in whichever lane that you're in. There's top, jungle, mid, support, or ADC, and support. And I would highly recommend putting in your lane opponent, as well as if you're bot lane, putting in your lane partner and their opponent as well. Now, the overtime analysis is based on when the game was typed in on this form, so I would recommend that you go back to a certain point on your match history, and then work forward from there. Now, this game right here I just recently typed out. So we have this right here. Now once you've got all the information typed out in the form, you can click log data and if it's already a file then you can update it otherwise it will just say data logged right here. And then there's also a load entry button on here which is just so if you mess up somewhere you can load up any entry that you want and fix it now when we click on the solo button down here you'll see that there's a normal and a ranked there will also be an ARAM in the future but that's not something that I have implemented yet now if you click on either normal or ranked you'll see this little role selector pop up and you click whichever role that you want to analyze on there and it will bring up your solo analysis form right here. Now we'll come back to this page in a minute. First I want to run through everything else with you. Now for every game that you have entered in this program, it'll put a champion over here for every champion that you've played in that lane. And then it'll put your games up here on the top with the most recent game that you played up here. Now if you click on this, it'll give you the stats for the game you've entered. In bot lane, it'll show you and your lane partner, as well as your opponents. In the other lane, it'll just put you and your lane opponent. And it's got your general statistics, your damage and your healing, and your vision, as well as charts showing both of those. Now, if you click on a champion name on the left, it'll bring up a summary page for that champion which has your totals and averages for every game that you've played with that champion in that role now up here there's an overtime if you have a champion tab selected it'll show that champion and then it will show stats that are your average increase or decrease throughout all the games that you've played on that champion as well as showing you over time with these charts what you've gotten. Now if you click up here on all champions, this overall tab right here shows you your top five champions with all of your basic statistics 
and then a modifier section which shows your different modifiers which is how it calculates which champions you're doing well on or not the vision mod is based off of one-third of all of the wards that you've placed and it gives you a point for each ward that you've destroyed and one for each pink ward that you've bought and then it takes an average from all your games that you played your modified KDA is an average of all of your kills plus half of all your assists and minus all of your deaths and the total modifier adds those and a couple other statistics together to show where you're at and then it has charts down here where you can compare your top five champions to each other now if you have the all tab selected and you click on overtime it shows similar to the other one but these are your top five most improved champions and it shows you your plus or minuses for average increases or decreases over time now I've got these zeros in here because they've only had one game played on them so there's nothing to compare that data to and it also shows charts of what you've gotten over time with your modified KDA, your gold per minute, and your vision modifier. Uh, like I said, keep in mind that this program is still in its alpha version, so there's plenty of features that are coming up. And yeah, go out, give it a try, uh, let me know what you say, think, and thanks for watching. Have a good night, guys.